On this super quick district tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can edit the preview section of your song. What I mean is when someone goes to preview your song on any platform, you can actually custom edit the exact time period they're going to hear from your song. This is actually way more important than most people think. Here's how to do it. So let's say I want to edit the preview for my track after 2 a.m., which I just released. I'm going to click here. And this is then going to pop up. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click download. The reason why I suggest downloading the song, even though maybe you have it backed up on your computer, is let's say if you have a different version of it, let's say if you have like a VIP version or whatever the case is, I'll have the track pulled up. That way, like I said, you want to make sure things are exactly equal just in case you have another version of the song. Then I want to click around and I want to find the best point that I want to have be for the preview of this song. Now, I am going to do a separate video on this because I actually have gone semi-viral just by picking the right portion in my song. Again, I'll do a video about that. This could be a tomato-tomato situation. Maybe you just want the chorus. Maybe you want the drop. For me as an EDM artist, I typically pick the build. So right when I click preview, you hear the build, then the big drop. So you want to find the portion on your song for you that you think fits the best preview. Again, this is more important than you think. Once you find it, let's say it's 107. I'll just pick that as an example. I am then gonna go to edit release. I'm gonna go down here and you can see down here, preview clip start time. I suggest not letting these streaming services decide. I'm gonna click this and I'm then gonna suggest the exact portion that I want. So I might go to here to let's say one minute and seven seconds, right? And then I click Submit it, Edit Request. That easy.